because all you green cart guys know and all the combine guys know that you're always waiting that green cart even though we are trying to hurry as much as we can always waiting on us gotta blame someone right might as well blame the poor green cart guy Good morning everyone, Irrigation Farmer back today and it's no day of harvest. We had to wait just a little bit for the grain to dry down like I was talking about uh, so we didn't cut anything this weekend. We're back at it, we're going to go try another field. This one I think is ready but we're going to try to finish one field so we're going to take everything over there. But first thing I got to do is put stock stompers on this. All right, so these are the stock stompers. So all they do is basically it takes the stocks and it hits it with this and it just pushes over. So the mount's on the other tractor that's sitting at the auger, so it doesn't really need it. So it's got to take these bolts off here. But you can see like this, this is what happens to these tires. They just get kind of worn down really bad. And that's what we're trying to save. Just tighten everything up. It was in the right spot, so tighten these and put this, put these bars in here, and then we'll be ready to roll. I always hate driving these grain carts on the road because you can't really see behind you at all. But I just discovered that window right there. There's actually two windows, so you can see straight through. So if you really, really pay attention and look back there, you can see if someone's behind you. But most of the time I just make people wait anyways because farm roads, I'm not going to really try to pull this sucker over. They can wait. We came pretty close to being full. We'll see if Daddy had seen cab corn because if you ever watch anyone else, that's kind of the don't do for harvest. It's getting close to it. He didn't spill, guys. We're all good. But he definitely is full. So what I'm doing is I'm just coming up beside him right here and then he's just just going to unload into the grain cart behind me. And then once he closes his auger or puts it away, then we're good to go and go unload. So yep, I just drive back and you can kind of see well, can't see too well, but basically right there you can see a stock stumper just pushing over those, all the corn there. But, go back over there and see to the semi. Yeah, I'd say she's pretty full. But, I don't think I spilled any. There's a little bit there on the ground. I think it's dad, not me. But yeah. Maybe a half load here, and then I'm going to have to start semi and start dumping into the auger. So you probably can't see him too well, but he's there on the whole other side. He's basically full, so he's probably got to wait on me again. As I said, it's tough being a green card driver. Always in the rush. Always the one behind. It's not my fault. I'm trying my best. I promise. Oh, yeah, you had to stop. Back up. All mine's worst nightmare. At least I didn't get cat corn, though. Oh, yeah, I should have finished getting the uh, stuff ready. But I'll probably just start unloading in the semi before I come back. Seems to look like the field's doing better. That's good. <clears throat> yeah, that's the 
life and excitement of green car driver. Back and forth, back and forth. That's all right. Semi is now officially full, and grain cart still has some corn in it, so I'm going to get things going, start emptying out everything, and then back to it. So, start the spinner up top, I'll start the tractor, let's get this bad boy going. <clears throat> this is totally off topic, but... Does anyone have a problem with mice and their tractors? We found out this one has um, where you can store the book underneath, the giant hole that mice can come straight through. It doesn't have a case covering or anything. So is there any smells or anything that kind of keeps mice away besides mothballs, something that doesn't, isn't gonna make me sick or anything? If you know anything, send me a message. Just gotta make a point, I got here before he was actually ready to go. And I'm pulling double duty, so I'm trying to empty the auger or the truck and the grain cart. Gold star for me. Finished with the field over here, so I'm in big red. And I, yep, and we're gonna go to the other auger or other bin site, set up the auger, and then finish the fields over there. But one field done, a few more to go. All right, in the safety suit again. Gotta go climb up there and get this auger set on this crane bin. Another nice workout. But I do wear the safety suit as, in case I fail, at least it catches me. Pretty nice view up here, but we'll just have him guide back and go from there. And now it's time to climb down. And you hear that? Raining corn! We can't rain rain, but make it rain corn. Pretty nice pile of corn so far, but still a long ways to go. Progress.